What's up, Fight fans? This is Harrison with BW Sports 1 covering SICP5. Here with me right now, I have Jay the Mongoose Curry, who just picked up his first win in the SICP cage. Not only that, it was his second win by third round TKO. Jay, tell us how it feels to finally get that dub in the SICP cage, man. To be honest with you, great feeling. It felt great to be in that cage. It felt great to perform in front of the crowd. And honestly, it felt good to be back in the weight column, for sure. What's looking at? Gage. Gage, BW Sports here. Jay, um, do you have any plans of what you want to do coming up in your career? Do you have any idea what you want to do next? Another another fight at SICP, maybe. And maybe a title, maybe? I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean to be personal with you, I feel like I have to earn my stripes, and that's my first win after three losses. Mm -hmm. So I'll take, I'll take another fight. And I feel like if I win that fight here in that well, we just had Dan come over here and you know let you know, hey, be ready for October. Yeah. So, come October, are you looking to get back in there and pick up another TKO win? Nah, in October, I'm looking to not get not let him move afterwards. Ooh, it was a clean knockout. Yeah, clean I, I, knockout. I missed the feeling from the first one. He was sleeping. I got another one. Um, is you said to me in your interview, you wanted to get back to what you did in your first fight, third round KO. This one went exactly the same way. What was getting back to what you did in the first fight? What was the difference in, in the first camp, this camp, and then the losses in between? So the difference was I relied on my grappling for sure, and I relied on my patience. Because my it's crazy, my nerves in the first fight wouldn't allow me to be sporadic anywhere. So then I veered off the game plan for the past, like, yeah, three fights, trying new stuff. And then I was like, wait a second, I'm a dominant force on top, and I can swing, I can crack, let me use it. So that's where I went with it, and I was like, we gotta get back, we gotta get back to the basics. We gotta get what we started with that got us to win. So. I mean, and we definitely saw that tonight. I mean, you were cracking when you needed to, but when the fight needed to go to the ground, you're the one that ended up on top. And yes, I mean, you can pretty much control all the grappling exchanges. For sure. For sure, that's, uh, that's, that's one thing I look to do when I am on the ground is maintain top pressure, maintain top control, get it done. Get it done. Hell yeah. All right, one more for me before we wrap up. Is this how you saw the play, uh, fight with Jude playing out, or is, did it go a little differently? Than yeah, because Jude's I, a tough opponent. I'll, I'll be honest with you. I didn't see it. I didn't see it leaving the second round on either one of our accounts. Either I could end it or he could end it. I didn't see it leaving the second round. Then when we got out of the second, I was like, yeah, it's a fight. Let's, let's, it's a fight now. <laughs> I mean, the first the first round, I, I could tell it was a fight. It wasn't going easy. <laughs> So, you know, we had to work him a little bit, had to wear him down, get his cardio, beat up on that cardio song, and just finish it up. Now, you said you didn't expect this fight to go into the second round. Cardio-wise, how did you feel going into the third? Beautiful. It was really just my foot. I, I, I had another two rounds in me. I'm ready for a five-round fight. Just your foot? You know, I, even though we go for three rounds, I train for six rounds. I train to be ready for six rounds. So yeah. that even when I'm fighting for titles, if it goes to the fifth, go I, still got, I still got another round for you. you know? Yep. So, yeah, I was, I was good on the cardio, but my foot was on, was on fire, like, seriously. After the second round, I'm, I don't know if you guys... You know, I was going like, to ask, uh, so yeah. when did that uh, the injury happen with your foot? Was it checking kicks in the second? Was yeah, that it, what was, did it, it happened, like, kind of in the middle of the second. I threw a leg kick, he checked it. Then I threw a head kick, he elbowed it. Mm. Like, he like he, he, time, he timed it perfectly. I'm not even going to, like, yeah. sugarcoat it. He timed it perfectly. He looked at it and everything, just leaned it out. And I kicked, the, like, my, the top the of my foot. Right against his elbow, and then that's when I was like, "Yeah, we're about to wrestle." <laughs> and that, and you—I mean, you did. You executed your game. Plan. Yeah, we're you started, about to wrestle. You, you wrestled him when you needed to, and you got that done. So, Gage, do you have any more questions for Jay? All right, Jay, that's it for me too, man. Congratulations on your second, third round TKO win. <laughs> Let that foot heal up, and I'm looking forward to seeing you in October. For sure, man. Good luck, man. SICP 5 Mayhem, Saturday, May 4th, from the Old National Events Plaza, Evansville, Indiana. SICP, we, we just, just hit, hit hard. hard.